watching City County Sports, The Coach's Corner with Dan Kroon. Brought to you by Bobby Wilson Home Furnishings, Penn Station East Coast Subs, Champion Ford Lincoln Mazda, and Via Media. Hi everybody, this is Barry Williams on Coach's Corner on Hometown TV. And I'm here today with Coach Dan Kroom, head coach of the Apollo Eagles. Well, Dan, you got your first win this weekend. Can you talk about Friday night? Well, it was good that we got a win. Uh, you know, it's uh, you, that first win kind of seems to be the toughest from time to time. But, you know, you can't rest on that. we got to get ready to get focused. And, uh, you know, we've got this week coming up to get better. And uh, we've got to use that wisely and, and get prepared for our district play. So, you know, it gives you a little bit of momentum. It gives you a little bit of confidence. And it's just uh, one of those things that you got to – uh, stay focused and uh, and uh, build off of what you did positive in the game. And who was your Penn Station subs player of the game? Our Penn Station sub player of the game was Ryan Duvall. Uh, Ryan finished the night with 28 tackles. He had, um, I think it was something like 18 solo tackles and 20 uh, assists along the game. So he ended up uh, with 28 for the game total. And, uh, I mean, he, he had a pretty spectacular night. We knew after the game that he was – he had a big night, you could just tell, and uh, he he was just all over the place, and he played really well. So he was the Penn Station player of the week. Did you have anybody else who stood out? Well, I thought that our defense as a whole stood out. You know, our other inside linebacker, Tyler Mills, had ten tackles. We had several other linebackers with five, six, seven, and eight. We had some linemen that were up there pretty good. So, you know, it was – I felt like our defense really played well. They got – they were aggressive. They got after the football. They played as a unit. They played as a team, and that's good to see. And so, you know, that, that's one of those positives that we have to build on and we have to get to, to get better each each day as we go along here. And, um, and it's positive points to build off of. Well, there you have it, folks. We'll be right back in just one moment. Stay tuned. I'm back breaking Bobby Wilson, and I'm slamming high prices. Now, Bobby's slamming high prices on both sides of the river. At Bobby Wilson's Home Furnishings New Evansville store, you'll find the same quality furniture at low warehouse prices. I'm slamming high prices. Bobby Wilson's Home Furnishings on 9th Street between J.R. Miller and Triplett in Owensboro, and now on North Main at Columbia in Evansville. Hi, this is Duke Brubaker from Champion Ford Lincoln Mazda. We're proud to be the sponsor of the Coach's Corner. Visit our website at championowensboro.com. This week's Coach's Corner special 2013 Ford Fusions, now as low as $19,990. Coach's Corner special 2013 Ford Edge SEs, now as low as $25,690. Those are our two Coach's Corner specials this week. Visit our website at championowensboro.com for a great lineup of new and used vehicles. How are you going to beat that? on City County Sports, and I'm here with Dan Kroom, head coach of the Apollo Eagles. Well, Dan, you got an off week coming up this week. How does an off week uh, affect a team who's just coming off their first victory? Does it help you or does it hurt you? Well, it's a, it can be a two-way street. You know, you've got to approach the week right. Um, you know, at this point in the season, you know, one of the areas that you want to make sure you do during the off week is you want to make sure that you get healthy for the, the end run of the season. You know, we've got uh, after this week, there's six games left uh, in the regular season, and you've got to be uh, healthy for those six games. But on the flip side, you have areas that you want to make sure you work on and you get polished up and you get cleaned up. And so it's still a work week, uh, but we, we've got to make sure we approach it in the right way so that we get healthy, but we also get take care of. Uh, and get things worked out that we we see that we need to get better at. So, um, you know, how you approach the week is a lot about it. You know, our guys need to understand that we've got to get better each day this week, use these uh, four or five days here to, to get better, and then um, 
um, also along the way get ourselves a little bit healthy. Now, technology has changed the way people coach now, especially with the advent of stuff like huddle, which gives you a really good way to see what's going on with your team. How do you guys use huddle? Well, it's it's really helpful multiple ways you know one is is it, it helps the coaches out because back in the day you used to drive and trade film and you know saturday morning you get up and you drive halfway across kentucky to go get two game films and you spend time and you talk to the coach and you miss that a little bit that camaraderie with the coaches uh but uh, it, it's beneficial because you know our kids have access to it they have access to it at any time as long as they have internet and so the way we use it is is you know, we, we put reports on there, and then they can go to the reports, and they can watch the, the, the plays based off the reports. You know, in the old days, uh, you know, we used to hand them a report and maybe get them some, show them some film along the way. Now they have the reports right there in, in the account, and they can click on, for example, you know, if you do a down and distance report, they can click and watch all their first down runs or watch all their first down plays or watch all their first down passes. And so they can really start to break it down and, and instead of watching the film, just watching the film as a whole. It kind of helps them along the way of, all right, this is what they like to do on first down. This is what they like to do on second down. These are their formations. So, and the, But the, the, the great thing about it is, is, like I said, in the old day, it was just a piece of paper. And you're looking at, okay, these are their formations. Now they've got the report there in front of them. They can click on it, and they can actually go see the video right then and there. So it's it's a big help. You know, it's, it's also been a learning curve because, you know, a lot of high school kids don't know how to watch film. And so, you know, the learning curve is you kind of kind of have to teach them how to watch the film along the way to help them out. So it's, it's beneficial. It's uh, in multiple ways. And, uh, you know, I think you won't find a coach in Kentucky that, that has it that doesn't speak highly about it and, and talk great about the program. Well, there you have it, folks. This has been Barry Williams on City County Sports with Coach Dan Kroom, head coach of the Apollo Eagles. Thanks for watching. You've been watching City County Sports, The Coach's Corner with Dan Kroon. Brought to you by Bobby Wilson Home Furnishings, Penn Station East Coast Subs, Champion Ford Lincoln Mazda, and Via Media. If you'd like to be a business sponsor of City County Sports Coach's Corner and show your school colors, call Via Media at 683-1094. What's better than being in the game? Being part of the game. Did you know your business can be a local broadcast sponsor of high-profile sporting events on cable television? Sports like Major League Baseball, NBA, NFL, and NASCAR. Not only will you be a visible sponsor, but you will also brand your business with top cable networks like ESPN, Fox Sports, and TNT. Call Via Media today and ask for Rod Wilkerson, the sports guru, to coach your business to the top of the standings.